This evening, a Klein ISD teacher is off the job after his offensive comments were caught on camera. The district says he is no longer employed as of today. But some wonder why this took so long. Jason Miles is outside the school with reaction from both sides. Jason getting a lot of attention on social media. Absolutely, Lynn. This incident was recorded uh, using a smartphone, though there's nothing to see because the phone was hidden. There is plenty to hear. Inside a Klein Collins High School theater arts class last week, race became the topic of discussion, although it's unclear what preceded it. I mean, if there's a word that you're not supposed to say, why are you saying it? I don't know. Why, why, why do the guys in my class go, you know, and say, man, crazy? Why do they say that? And why is it because I'm a white guy, I can't say that? I can't say the N-word. The white male teacher goes on to question why there isn't a white history month, along with comments about other ethnic groups. At this time, I can tell you this individual is no longer employed in Klein ISD, and we are still investigating this incident. The district's announcement about the teacher's employment comes days after parents say they alerted the school about the video and wonder if that's the only reason the teacher is gone. Your words sir were absolutely offensive some of them joined activist quan lx today outside the school including those whose children were in the classroom it's ridiculous it's just it's hard to listen to without getting angry it's upsetting it's just really upsetting they hope the ongoing investigation includes looking at this now former teachers past because if you've got that kind of racist mindset about black people hispanics and indians who knows what you did with your grade book in an email to families, the school said it regrets students were impacted by the teacher's language. And this is a human resources issue. The district would not say if this teacher was fired or if he resigned when confronted about the results of the district's investigation, which again is ongoing. You can read the district's full statement on KHOU.com. Lynn, back to you. All right, Jason Miles with the report at the high school. Thank you.